Hey everybody, Justin with VMP Performance here. Ice tanks. What is the point of having an ice tank with your power adder car, supercharger, turbocharged, anything with boost? Well, ice tanks are there to provide additional cooling. But first, let's talk about what the heck we're cooling anyways. If you take a look at our VMP Odin Supercharged Mustang here, you see the kit adds a reservoir and has some additional lines. There's also a low temp radiator and a small coolant pump. That system circulates water through the intercoolers in the supercharger lid into a reservoir and then back down to the pump and through the heat exchanger. We can throw a little diagram up on the screen to show you how that all works. The basic premise of this system is that the supercharger, when it creates boost, it creates heat and that heat has to be removed somehow. So this is where we start. Now we're getting to the point of the video. I've got another VMP Odin car here and it has the Odin ice tank. The tank has a drain on it. You can drain it down to about halfway and add 10 pounds of ice. Now you are harnessing stored thermal energy to get your air temps down even further. And that is the point of an ice tank. Now, hey, uh, where do we go from here? Because bigger is better, right? The VMP Odin ice tank was designed to fit under the hood for easy installation. It's quick, it's very accessible to just about every consumer. There's an evolution of everything though, and people tend to put really, really big tanks in the trunk of cars. And that is the next question I wanna answer. Why, what, how, where? And for that, we're gonna go look at this Whipple supercharged car. So this Whipple supercharged car, it has no underhood tank. And Whipple actually does that on purpose. Normally they have a coolant tank in the fender and a fill point up here. The particular owner of this vehicle has installed a full on trunk mounted tank in the back of the car. Let's go take a look. The spare tire well is a great place to store crap in your Mustang, right? So what better place than to put a huge five, seven gallon tank, all the associated plumbing, um, intercooler pump, drain valve, and what this allows you to do is get a whole 20 pound bag of ice, maybe even you overfill it with 30 pounds of ice and harness even more of that thermal energy for quick bursts of speed. Drag racing, half mile racing, mile racing. That is where the ice tanks really come in. And that is the point of the ice tank. Follow along for more information on ice tanks. Make sure you like, subscribe and share. I'll see you next time.